There are two interesting things going on here. Well, the first is, of course, that there's a ground scraper thrush there, two of them, one far and the other quite close. There it is. Now, the ground scraper thrush, for some of you, will be a new bird for the bird list, I imagine. They're not very common here. Now, Brian, you call them the cow bird. Could you explain that? It looks like a cow. Yeah. Apparently, to Brian, that looks like a cow. <laughs> <laughs> Right, good. And then <laughs> uh, chasing, chasing that little ground scraper thrush as it scrapes along the ground is a crowned lapwing, which is going... <coughs> looking very cold here on this blustery morning. But you can see why it's called a crowned lapwing. And you probably definitely have that one on your bird list. Just notice quickly how it doesn't have a back toe. You see that? You may just be able to make out there that it doesn't have a back toe. It's only got three front-facing toes, and that is because it is not a it is not a, a, a perching bird. It is a coursing bird. It runs after its prey, which are normally ants or termites or things on the ground. You see that? That's really cool. We often talk about that, but we seldom are able to see it in such glorious detail as we are on this and Arethusa International airstrip. Let's go and have one